Hey guys, so this past week or a few days ago, I went up to Box Lunch and they recently just came out with two new DVZ pops, as you could tell by the thumbnail. Um, and I'm really excited for these pops. Uh, I'm more interested in the DVZ pops that they do with different molds or completely different costumes. Most people uh, have been like, kind of butthurt by the latest kind of pops that they came out with with DVZ, but I was excited because they haven't done too many of the Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan, uh, or the Super Saiyan Blue pops. The first one they have did was this one, which is uh, Goku Super Saiyan Blue, and the Vegeta, which came out, with the GameStop uh, box for, it was like a holiday mystery box. And one of them had the metallic Super Saiyan God Vegeta's. But this, uh, about two days ago, they came out with this. And I'll get some uh, up closer footage of it for you guys. Um, this is Goku, Vegeta, and their baseball outfits. Uh, it's an episode of Super where Beerus... And his brother have like a um, baseball kind of match to see which universe was the best and kind of like a, a team morale builder headed into the tournament. So the first one, pretty dope because I haven't taken these out yet. Goku has a number one on his the back of his jersey. You probably can't see because of the light, but uh, and that's that's that one, the first one. And the second one is Vegeta with blue jersey on, and he has a baseball mitt. Uh, oh, get down there, guy. Don't fall. <laughs> He's top heavy. We'll just leave him like that. Uh, these were about 20 bucks. They had plenty of them at Box Lunch, and I'm sure they have them online. Uh, you can get some discount codes and uh, get like maybe four or five bucks off and still maybe pay shipping or whatever. Oh, nice. I didn't even notice these. This helps. They come with uh, little stands that were taped to the bottom. Normally, they're attached to the pops. So they must have did that for lack of room, probably. Goes right on his left foot. He stands. And then... Goku's. Ah! I assume that they're the same stand, which is kind of dope. Maybe they work for other ones. Uh, so they come with stands, too. They will be on the bottom of the plastic casing that's inside the pops. Um, re I'm really glad they finally did something different. Uh, normally, they've been just doing kind of the same characters with the same molds, kind of. So these are really exciting that they have a completely different mold, different costume. Um, recently, they came out with a metallic version of Super Saiyan God Goku doing a Kamea Blast. And they have a, com or a base form that was a GameStop exclusive pop and tee. So they haven't really done too many of the Super Saiyan Blue forms up until recently with this, the two baseballs. And they'll be coming out with uh, uh, Vegeta. Oh, it's over 9,000. That's what the box will say here on the side. It'll say it's over 9,000, and that's going to be a Hot Topic exclusive. And they're also going to be coming out with a Goku Super Saiyan God a uh, hot topic exclusive with his clothes like battle worn so his his outside shirt the orange one will be all ripped up and I, th I think i'll be able to find it but uh besides these these two um they'll be coming out with this next week um uh final flash uh vegeta and a piccolo meditating They'll both be New York Comic Con pops uh, shared with other stores if you can't make it out to the convention. And the Vegeta will be at Hot Topic and the Piccolo will be at 
GameStop. Also at ThinkGeek as well. Um, if you give me a second, I'll show you the ones that they have coming out here soon. Uh, Hot Topic Nerdette, uh, she does videos maybe like once a week or so and shows like what's coming up for the next few months. Uh, these were the hints that they gave the box. And that's really weird too. Well, not actually, it's more accurate. The Z, uh, you could you could already tell is the over. It's over nine thousand, and there's a super that is the the Goku for his like battle worn costume. Let's see. Yep, there they go. So here's the first one, which is the Goku. And the next one, which is the Vegeta over 9,000, he's uh, crushing his scouters from the scene in the show where he uh, goes to read Goku's um, like Kai level and it's over 9,000. So then he crushes it out of frustration. And they, the other ones that they released was a Jack Skeleton with a snake. Um, Invader Zim and Gurr, uh, Back to the Future, and the two DBZ pops. So those are uh, what's coming out. Really excited for those. Um, make sure you guys get out to the conventions if you can, because DBZ pops are kind of, you know, hit or miss depending on if they have enough. So let me know if you guys ended up getting these two guys or if you plan on getting any other New York City Comic Con pops. Uh, check me out later. Till then, uh, subscribe, uh, like the channel, and yeah, just comment anything that you got coming up pop-wise. Take it easy.